how to connect an external domain to your UCraft website. Hi, Jay here and welcome to this channel. If this is your first time on the channel, you are welcome. I have a video on how to create a free website with UCraft. So please check it out and uh, I'll drop it in the description. Also, you can check other videos on this channel. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you find value in this video after watching. All right, so locate the website that you want to connect the domain to. In my case, I have only one, so I'll click it. All right, so click on dashboard. Click on domain. Click uh, connect domain. Connect existing domain. This is if you want to buy a domain from uh, Ucraft. But in our case, we want to connect a standard domain. All right. Okay. So now you type the name of your domain without the www or the HTTPS. All right. All right. So after typing, then you click connect. All right. So this is the DNS record that uh, Ucraft uh, has generated for you. Okay. So what you have to do now, you're going to have to copy this and move over to your domain host and update your DNS record over there. All right. So in this case, I'm going to copy this. All right. So copied. All right. So let's move over to our domain host. In my case, I'm with a uh, name chip. You might be with GoDaddy or, you know, name mesh. The process is still the same. All right. So I have to locate the domain that I want to update. In this case, I want to update this one, bitlossway.com. So what I have to do, I have to click uh, manage. All right, so make sure you change uh, the custom DNS. I was using it on another platform. All right, so now I'm going to have to change it to name chip basic DS DNS. Okay. This is what you want. So you change it. Then you click save. The process is still the same. Like I said before. All right. So once you're done, if you've not used it before, it's going to be different. Okay. I'll show you how it's going to be. Yeah. So this is how it's going to be. If you've not used it before. All right. All right, so click advanced DNS. All right. All right. So right now you just have to click add new record. All right. Then uh, let's go back and check which one is it. All right. So it's record A. Okay. And uh, as you can see, the numbers are still the same. So we don't need to come back and keep copying each other. All right. Uh, and all we have, the difference is at and the WW sign. Okay. So we don't need to come back again. When we come back, we are coming to click check. All right. So let's go back. All right. So this is a record. Okay. Because remember it says, where is it? Record A is still the same as a record. Okay. So you click a record. Then you click on the add sign. Where is it? Add. Then uh, you paste the DNSN record here. Control V. All right. Then uh, you click the check sign. Then you add the second one. A record. Now you're going to type www, all right? And make sure it's small uh, letters, not in caps. Then you come down here, then you paste. Then you click on check. The numbers are still the same, but this is the difference, okay? Okay, so when you are done, you have to do this. You can have uh, these records here and have that here. So what you have to do, you have to delete these two. Okay. So you delete this. Yes. 
Then you delete this. Yes. All right. So now you're done with the uh, name chip. So you move over to Ucraft. Then you click on check. It says uh, it may take up to 72 hours. All right. But most of the time in about half an hour time, it should be working. Okay. So when you come here, the status to uh, should change. Okay. So we'll come back in uh, half an hour time. Okay. All right. So half an hour later is connected. All right. So it's not even close to an hour. All right. So I'll go to the domain app to check the worldwide uh, propagation uh, status. All right. Because uh, it's connected here, but uh, I just want to know if uh, globally it's uh, connected so I can, you know, access it. All right. So I'll close this browser and I'll go back to dashboard to check it out. All right. Okay. Okay. So you click on domain. And there it is. Connected. All right. As you can see, it's connected globally. Okay. But uh, the reason why you see this, because this is a free website, all right? So don't worry about it, okay? Because uh, this domain is sitting on this uh, temporary domain, okay? But now this is your permanent domain. All right, so right now I'm going to go ahead and check it out, okay? So we open the new browser, then we type in and enter. And uh, boom. There we have it. This is live and colored. And uh, I'll see, maybe I might have to sell this website to, you know, a woman or somebody, you know, for weight loss. I'm not so much into weight loss, but hey. Anyhow, uh, so if you want to promote it, you just double click, all right? Then uh, highlight everything and uh, copy. All right. The only difference is it's going to say like uh, this website is created with uh, Ucraft. All right. And it's like a promotion you're doing for them, you know, because they give you free website. You also give them free advert or free commercial. All right. But hey, who cares about this if you don't have the money to spend? OK. All right. So I might have to customize this and just. Uh, and just sell it to somebody or you know something all right all right so thanks for watching and hopefully you can go ahead and create your own website all right and uh, please like comment and share okay and don't forget to subscribe 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 thank you so much bye bye